Hey everyone, it's Jamie. Welcome back. So today's video is another Dollar Tree haul and I found some really cute things. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what I found. Now I am trying to get as many Dollar Tree hauls filmed as I can today because unfortunately my husband lost his job. And so with him being home, I can't film my videos because he's just loud. <laughs> he likes to watch TV or mess around with a dog. So, um, and he just, you know, he's a man. So anyway, um, I figured while he's gone, he went to go get new tires put on my car. So while he's gone, I'm going to go ahead and film my videos so I can get them all done and out of the way and ready for you guys to, to watch this week. So anyway, um, I'm going to go ahead and start off with showing you what I found. Now I've never seen this at Dollar Tree before. Um, I think they may have have something similar to this just in the I think it's assured brand or whatever but this is the Mueller brand so it's the Mueller life care for her and it's the contour wrist um, it's just a like a support a wrist support so I got one um, they had these in small medium and large in the women's and then they also had men's um, but the men's, all I seen was the large size. So, um, I don't know if they have any small or medium for men or not, but, um, anyway, I went ahead and grabbed one of these since I had never seen one of these before. And I do have carpal tunnel and a little bit of arthritis in my wrist and my hands. So, and my left hand has been giving me issues lately where the tips of my fingers, like my fingertips, like my first two fingertips, have been going um, kind of numb and tingly. So I, I'm pretty sure it's my carpal tunnel is what's causing it. But um, so anyway, I thought I'd grab one of these just to try it out and see how it works. And it says it's moderate support specifically designed and contoured for women. And it is um, latex free support for arthritis, swelling and general wrist pain. So you did get one in there. I thought I'd just grab this one, try it out, see if I liked it. If I thought I, you know, if it was going to be helpful, I may go back and get another one for uh, my other wrist. But I did just go ahead and grab the one. Um, while I was over there and sort of like the hair care, I don't even know, the pharmaceutical <laughs> side, they had this and it's a hair bonnet, or they're calling it a hair bonnet. I call it a shower cap, but... Um, this one is just in the color black and um, they did have these in several different uh, patterns but I just wanted a black one and I got this one because um, I don't know if it's the weather or if it's my age but um, my hair has been really really dry and brittle and breaking off and I'm wanting to do like a hot um, oil hair treatment or like a hair mask like a deep conditioning hair mask or something and so anyway, I thought if I did that, I could put the um, shower cap over it. That way it kind of, you know, keeps it in there and keeps it all in one place because usually those hair masks take, take like, you know, 15 minutes or something. So anyway, thought I'd go ahead and grab this so I could do my little hair treatment. <laughs> um, okay, so I went over by the floral, like the um, crafting section with their ribbons and and all of that but they have got some more of the nautical jute rope which they have been at least around my Dollar Trees they have been sold out of this for months and I ran out so I needed some more so I was excited to see that they did have um, a new shipment of this come in but I am noticing that it is only eight feet now so I don't know if they're gonna get any of the um, the longer ones in because they used to sell it, I think it was like 9.6 feet. And then I think they have one that was like 11 feet or something. But this one is just the 8 foot, eight foot one. And I did go ahead and just grab six of these. I probably should have got more. Um, because I use this stuff in all kinds of uh, DIYs and things like that that I do. So um, went ahead and I did grab six of those. Uh Okay, I went ahead and picked this up. I've seen these in there, and I always just pass it by thinking, well, I don't need it. But I have been burning uh, more candles lately, especially through 
um, the last couple weeks because we we had power outages and everything with the winter storm that we had. So I burned candles. Um, but I just went ahead and grabbed it because, you know, blowing out candles for me bending down. I have long hair and I don't know how many times I've bent down to blow out a candle and my hair, <laughs> my hair gets singed because I got too close. So I thought this would come in handy. So it's just a candle snuffer and um, I got the black one. They had it in gold, silver, and I think that might be it. Gold, silver, and black maybe was the only color. So I just grabbed the black one. Um, something that I've seen, and I've seen other people haul these. And I have also seen these at uh, like Walmart, Michaels, um, Hobby Lobby. But they have the Floral Garden LED string lights. You get 10 lights, but these are the ones that are, they're the little fairy lights, but they are, um, they have greenery on them. They're like little vines. So I thought those were really pretty, and I know elsewhere they are more than a dollar. But I did grab two of those, and I went ahead and opened one of them so that you guys can see. Now, I did not, I don't have any batteries for this right now, but... Um, you will need two double A batteries for it, but look, isn't this so pretty with the, um, the leaves and everything on there? I think it's so pretty. So I did grab two of those. I love their LED, um, little fairy lights. Okay. Um, I never, ever buy magazines from the Dollar Tree. I just don't do it. Uh, because they're so thin and I figure a dollar is too much for you know something so thin but if you go to Walmart or you know the grocery store you're standing in line to check out you see the magazines well the magazines are like fifteen dollars twenty dollars for a magazine that's too much why why would you pay that much for a magazine it's insane <laughs> so um, anyway when I was in Dollar Tree I seen this one and I thought well for a dollar I'll go ahead and pick it up but it's the Small Space Organizing uh, Magazine. So there's, I don't know, I just thought this was a really good deal. And this is the time of year, you know, to be uh, thinking about organizing your space. So, and I need all the help I can get when it comes to my craft room. Y'all should see it. <laughs> it's horrible. It's just horrible. I have so much stuff and nowhere to put it. But, um, so they're showing you, like, you know, giving you some ideas. There's something for... Uh, your laundry room. I'm sorry about the glare. Laundry room. And then I guess that would be like an entryway or maybe your mudroom. Or maybe, is that your garage? Oh, for the garage. That's what it says. Right up here. Garage. So yeah, that's some pretty good ideas there. So anyway, I was excited to find that. And I figured, you know, for a dollar, I'll go ahead and get it. And it does say here that it's regular, um, $4.99 was the retail price for it. So a dollar is pretty good. Okay. Now I was going by the floral, like where the seeds and um, all the pretty little garden uh, decorations, like the lawn stakes and stuff are. But I cannot believe that I found these at the Dollar Tree, guys. I cannot believe it. Look at these flower pots. These things are massive. They are so big and they're calling it a planter. Um, it does not have a size on here, at least not that I can see, but it's humongous. I did grab two of them, grab two of them. These are so big and I have bought flower pots from uh, Walmart that are this size and they were way more than a dollar. Um, now these are, you know, plastic which is fine, um, but my goodness, these things are huge. I just couldn't believe it, and I love this color. This color is like a sort of a taupey color, taupey gray color, but oh my gosh, huge. So if you guys see these at your Dollar Tree and you need like big plants, big big pots for your plants, I like big pots and I cannot lie, um, grab them because these are humongous and they are way more than a dollar anywhere else. These would be good for if you want to grow like, um, tomatoes or something, you can put the tomato cage that should fit right on there. Grow your tomatoes. Oh my gosh. Strawberries. I don't know, but 
amazing. I couldn't believe I found that at the Dollar Tree. And they did have um, other colors than just that uh, taupey color. Okay, so um, they had some new pot holders and oven mitts. So I did go ahead and grab um, a couple. Now they did have these, and I am sorry about that light. Um, they did have these in three different designs. These were the only two that I, you know, I really liked. So um, I just grabbed these. So these are the pot holders you get two. This one says bloom where you are planted. I think it's really pretty. It's got the bicycle on there, the faux wood, really pretty. So you do get two and I do like the back, the color. Um, it's like a teal, it's like a teal blue color. I don't know, It just it's coming off more blue blue in the camera, but it's got sort of a green tint to it. So anyway, I thought that is really pretty. So I grabbed one of those and then this one says, let your dreams blossom. And it's like this really hot, like fuchsia pink color. And I'm sorry about the lighting. I may have to, to change my setup here. But anyway, I think that is really pretty. And you do get two and it's just the plain pink on the back. Um, they also had the uh, oven mitt. And I got them this, saying the same thing, bloom where you planted, and then let your dreams blossom. So it's the same design, um, same kind of thing on the back. So I thought those were really pretty. And then um, they had these, which I think these are so pretty. They did have another design with other flowers on it, but um, I really liked just these two. So I did get four of each of these and they do go with the pot holders and the oven mitts. So this one has the um, butterflies on it, which I think is really pretty and with these orange flowers. And then on the back, it's just the screen green color. And I am, I, can, I may have to, switch positions here people the sun is starting to go down one moment okay maybe that will help i don't know I'm, i've kind of i backed up as best as i can <laughs> so um where was i okay so these placemats i did grab four of these which these give me like that reed drummond pioneer woman kind of feel because you know she does these kinds of designs with the flowers um i know hers are typically like the teal green color and like red pops of red or whatever which i think is really pretty so anyway i grabbed four of these and then the back side is like this teal blue or teal green color it's so pretty but um i got these i'll probably put some on my table maybe but i'm also thinking about doing like um just throw pillows making a couple of throw pillows with them but anyway, I'm not sure, but I thought these were really pretty. So I went ahead and grabbed those. And then um, they had these uh, tea towels or hand towels, whatever you want to go. They're calling them kitchen towels. But um, I went ahead and just grabbed one of each of these so that they match the um, pot holders. And so it's the bloom where you are planted and then the let your dreams blossom. And they have the same writing on the front and the back so anyway I thought those were really pretty so I did just grab one of each of those because these are the ones that um, they're more for decoration than they are for uh, you know they don't really have a purpose like drying towel or drying your hands or drying dishes I don't feel like um, but they do look really pretty just hanging around for decor so um, I went ahead and grabbed those okay something else that's not doesn't have anything to do with spring or anything like that really. But um, I got these, not because I have a baby or know anyone that has a baby right now, but these are so stinking cute. And I got these because um, I'm making gnomes and I wanted my gnomes to have some feet. So I thought I'd try grabbing some of these baby socks just to see if maybe I can make little gnome feet with them. I don't know if it's going to work or not. I just, I don't know. I thought I'd try it. So, um, I did grab these. You get two pair baby socks. These are the six to 12 months. Um, so if you have babies, but I think these are really pretty. I love the um, polka dots on there. So you got the dark pink and then the lighter pink. And then these are 12 to 24 months. You get two 
Um, they're just a plain, plain color. So I got um, this violet purple and then the white. I think these are really pretty. So, and they, you know, spring colorish. So I did grab one of those. Okay, and then the last three or the last two things that I found, I was excited to find because I have not seen these at my Dollar Tree and I've seen everybody hauling them. And so I had to get them. <laughs> these are so cute. They are the little gnomes, the little ceramic or glass gnomes. These are so dang cute. Now they only had the pink and the green. I wish they would have had the other colors, but they didn't. And they only had four left. So they had two green and two pink. And of course, I did go ahead and I, I bought all four of them. I know, shame on me, but I'll probably never see these again. So I did clean off the shelf. There was only four. So anyway, I grabbed two pink and two green. But anyway, I think these are just the cutest things ever. I'm sure everybody has seen these already, but they are so darn cute. Um... I have been trying so hard to find the really cute Easter decor that I've seen everybody else haul. Like the signs, the gnome signs, the truck signs. Can't find them. So I'm probably either they've been to my Dollar Tree and people have picked them over already or they're not coming. <laughs> so I don't know. We'll just have to see. But anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Uh, subscribe if you haven't. I hope that you guys are having a wonderful day. I wanted to thank you all for watching and I'll talk to you all later. Bye!